All right, we are back in business on the field. As you can see, 10 more sheep being moved out to the set out point for this very first of two outruns and lifts that we'll be doing here in our championship round. We welcome to our handler's post from Andover, Connecticut, Mr. Beverly Lambert and Lee. Notice how intently the competing Border Collie watches those sheep coming out there, very much tuned in to both sheep and handler at this stage. And our score comes in for Alicia Lund and Nora at 217, 217.
And with that, she's got her 20 sheep all tucked together here in one group. Finish the fetch line now down to the post. Trying to get this group of 20 to land just to her right-hand side, then swept around clockwise in behind. And once they have crossed that line in behind the post, then the two outruns, the two lifts, and the fetch have all been judged at that stage. And we'll start working on judging the drive portion of the course. Finding the straggler there and tucking her up. Gather up all those 20 sheep, got through the fetch panels or through the drive panels very nicely there. Bring them back down now just a little bit here. Find that line left to right across the field here for our cross drive. Once again, an imaginary line drawn on the field on those first set of drive away panels to the cross drive panels. We try to keep the sheep straight and true if we can on that line. Making the adjustments necessary there to keep the sheep pointed toward the opening there between the panels as they try to escape just a little bit low there. Push them back up, find that line, make the turn here, get all these heads on the same, going the same direction. See if we can't point them through the panels. They're still trying to go low.
make the turn now. Get the dog on the top side there. Push these sheep back around. Point them toward the shedding ring. Sort of targets the center of the ring there. That's sort of the line that she's looking for here. Inside the shedding ring now, get these 20 sheep all tucked in there. Border Collie stays to the outside, making sure that they are inside. Have to do all the separating or shedding, as we call it, inside the marked circle. There have the little piles of sawdust that clearly mark the size of the circle. There's the same size, 40 yards across, that we used in the preliminary competition, but now we have 20 sheep inside. There's a nice size group. Should we try to get these to move off to the side just a little bit. Reminder for you open handlers, we'll have your presentation ceremonies right after this run on the field. So make sure you've got yourselves and your dogs all sort of gathered up over here behind the judge's trailer for the presentation ceremony. So the dog's job here in this type of international shed is to hold on to, can control, the sheep we are trying to save. And of course, ultimately, that's the five wearing the red collar, the orange collars.
And with that, she has her international shed. She has five collared sheep, and she is headed for the pen. The gate is open. Now she must remain holding on to that rope throughout the entire penning process. She cannot leave that gate and go help her dog. So it is up to the dog to bring the sheep, get them tucked inside, and she will shut that gate. Gotta find just the right amount of pressure to put on these sheep to get them to drift in there without trying to explode back out of that opening. She does not want them to regroup those sheep that are already on the outside. Oh, slowly, slowly, here we go. Yes, it is. That's a pin. That is Beverly Lambert and Lee completing the course here. And with that, we are once again reminding all of you handlers here in the top 21, we need your presence and your border collie over here for our presentation ceremonies to begin shortly. 